Hi there, welcome to Bite Size Piano. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to play the piano accompaniment keyboard part to Cardigan by Taylor Swift. So I'm going to teach this one using the piano sound, but it is more of like this sound. Like an E piano sound, I just don't have quite the right exact sound, but it, if you have this sound that's similar, it sounds really nice on this sound as well. Um, so if you have a keyboard with different sounds like mine, mine just isn't quite close enough to the real sound, so I'm going to do it on the piano. So I, I am going to sing each section, it's fairly repetitious. I have left the chords and lyrics in the description below if you find that useful. This one is in the key of E flat major, so on the screen now are all the notes of the scale of E flat major. So the chords of the melody are formed using those notes. Here is middle C as a reference, and the right hand is going to start well, it's only going to be in this position for the entire song. So you're in um, a C minor, five fingered C minor position. So it's thumb on C, two on D, three on E flat, four on F, five on G. So the right hand is mostly going throughout. There is some variation as well, and I'll go through this specifically what's, what's going on. But the main part of the right hand is going, you're going to play C and G together and then F, keep that C down, E flat and then F. Or you could replay the C with the F if you wanted to. So it's in a swing motion. So it does that twice and then on the third time we've got and it plays F, E flat, C and it does the first pattern again. So that's mostly what's happening in the right hand throughout and it's the left hand that changes. The left hand is going to be playing in fifths so not full chords. I'll give you two options with the left hand. So the first chord is based around F minor, but you're not going to be playing the middle note because we're playing in fifth, so they're like more neutral sounding chords. So you can play F, C, F, but if you can't reach an octave, just play F and C. So we're going to go, and they come in together, and then you keep playing those notes. But if you're just playing the fifth, it will be like this. four times and then you do the right hand bit again and then I'm going to come up to the B flat and F again play that four times each one's played four times and then do the second pattern in the right hand and then we're going to come in with the F and then A flat and E flat in the left hand Again, really slow. So um, I'm going to sing that now, so it just comes in, this is the verse. Hi there, just quickly before we continue, if you are enjoying the video so far, please consider hitting that like button and say hi in the comments section below. If you're brand new here, please consider subscribing, you know where the button is, and make sure to hit that notifications bell so you're notified every time I upload a new tutorial and you can be the first to learn. I've left a load of playlists in the description as well to get you started. I hope you enjoy the rest of the tutorial and let's continue. Vintage tea, brand new phone, high heels on, cobblestones, when you are young they assume you know nothing. Sequin smile, black lipstick, sense you
now we're into the pre-chorus. I'm not entirely sure if I'm honest what to call all the sections, so this is just what I'm calling it. But I know that when I'm looking at the lyrics in front of me, different websites have called it the different things, so this is just what I'm going to call them. So now we're into the... I'm going to call it the pre-chorus. I knew you dancing in your Levi's. That part, so this is a pre-chorus now. So the right hand is going to go... And then you play G. And with that you play... E flat, B flat, E flat, or just E flat and B flat. And you go back to playing the original pattern with B flat in the left hand. The, the, the other one with the A flat. Sing that section now. But I knew you dancing in your leaf eyes, drunk under a street light. I, I knew you hand under my sweatshirt, baby, kiss it better. And then we got I. And then we're back into the F minor again, it's the same as the verse. When it felt like I was to look out again under someone's bed You pulled me on and said I was your favourite And carry on doing that A friend to all is a friend to none Chase two girls, lose a And it's back into the pre-chorus again. But I knew you playing hard and seeking, giving me weekends. I, I knew you, you hopping on the line once in twenty lifetimes. I, vintage tea, brand new phone, high heels on, cobblestone. but slightly different. Um, so once you've gone, you're going to play the A flat in the left hand and then G, E flat. And the left hand's going to come up to C and G, so it, this is actually C minor chord but we're not playing the third. So then the right hand you're going to play C, E flat, F and then Next bit goes so down to the E flat, and the right hand goes C, E flat, F, G with the left hand, E flat, C, and then up to the A flat, and the right hand goes G, F, 
E flat, C. I'll just do that again. into this post chorus. It's just on the screen now, so it's all very similar. So that just comes in by itself. And then she starts singing. You do that again, and then she starts singing. goes down to F, the F, and then we have C, A flat, F, and then change that to the B flat 5, G, D. So the notes on the screen again, it's nothing really different, that different to what we've already been doing.
the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it and that it's useful. If you'd like to leave a piano tutorial request, you need to click on this video, which takes you through to my official request space. You do need to be subscribed. All requests are noted and considered. So I look forward to seeing you over there.